Hello, Cornerstone. Just want to take a minute and show you some next steps that you can do with our new app called Church Center. Once you have it downloaded, if you go ahead and click on it and log in, I want to show you how you can update some of your um, profile settings for you and your family. So if you look up here at the top, there's a little bit of an arrow right here. You're going to click on there. And then you'll see it has your contact and profile information. So let's go ahead and click there. And this is just showing you your personal things um, that is your information. So go ahead and give it a quick check and make sure that everything is up to date. If you want to add your birthday, your anniversary, you can add lots of different information in there. So go ahead and do that. Um, if you make any changes, you're going to want to hit update so that that is recorded in there. Um, then another thing that's really great to do is to look at your household. Um, if you have your spouse and your kids in here, they are going to all show up in your household. And you may want to just go in there and check and make sure um, if your kid's information is correct. So I'm going to go here and look at Aiden's. Um, I'll see that he's got his uh, mobile number is correct. Um, his email is correct. So I just want to update all of that information there. And again, if I make any changes, I'm going to want to hit on update right up here in the corner to make sure that that is, um, that is correct. Um, okay, we're going to go ahead and go back, hit the back arrow up here, um, and we're going to look at directory profile. This is another key step here. So I'm going to click on directory profile. This is going to show you right now what is going to show up in the directory so that people that have access to the directory, um, they're going to see all of this information about me. So if I want to take something out, if I don't want my birthday to be on there, all I need to do is click it. It will go away and it won't show up in the directory. Um, okay. Also, if you go down here to your household, you can update your household photo. You would do that just by clicking right here on edit. And it was going to let me choose. I can take a new photo. I could choose from um, the library, um, kind of have those options there. Um, also, if you go down, it shows you the people in my household. So I can edit information for Andy. I can also, go if I keep scrolling down, I can edit, um, show what kind of information I want to show for my family. So if maybe for my kids, um, maybe you only want to show their names and their picture. You don't want any identifying information in the directory. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and take that off of there. And let me show you what that looks like. So let's say I go ahead and take off everything for my kids. Um, and I hit update. Um, then I want to show you when I go to the directory what that's going to look like for everyone. So I go over here to the directory. I'm going to go down to the Wilson household. I'm going to click on here. And now you'll see it has the information for Andy and I, but for our kids, it only has their names. So that just gives you some different options there. All right, that's all for now.